gratitude. First of all, I'm grateful to my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Without him, none of this is possible. So I'm grateful for him, grateful for my team, uh, grateful for the organization, president, GM, players. Um, just a lot of gratitude. Yeah, I think uh, when I first came in, uh, I remember we had a conversation, uh, me and Coach, you know, he said, uh, you're the NBA champion, we're the early champion, you know, now let's go get another one. Um, but for me, it's a team sport, it's not golf, tennis. So coming in and finding a role with a team that's been together for four years is not always easy. So in the beginning, you know, a little bit of struggles trying to figure out exactly, okay, I don't need to do too much on offense and and trying to find, figure out my role, um, understanding that defense is someone that something that can stick, be consistent every single night. Um, once I figured that out, um, I was able to allow the game to come to me a little bit more. Early on, we gave up a lot of points on offensive rebounds, but um, after we corrected that and I told coach, let me guard you all, like regardless, let me, let me make it a little bit tougher on him. Um, then I feel like we started getting a little momentum on, on uh, defense. As soon as we got, a, as soon as we always say like, uh, when you get three stops in a row, um, that's a big accomplishment. So as soon as we got, you know, a few stops in a row and they were really stalling on and we started boxing out, that's what I knew. It was over because we started making some shots and we were getting offensive rebounds. So um, that's kind of when I knew. Yeah, I mean, uh, for me, I know if they put Yol on me uh, to save him on offenses, there's no way he should be able to box me out. So every single time I got to crash and make him have to box me out and hopefully that'll make him a little bit, a little less stronger on offense.